A summer tradition coming to a close today with the Wisner Market holding its final market of the season this afternoon. Our 18 News reporter Nick Dubina stopping by the market to see how the 2023 season went and how some are already looking to 2024. It is a hot and sunny day here at Wisner Park as people are out gathering for lunch and enjoying the last Wisner Market of the season. At Wisner Park in downtown Elmira, people soaked in the sun and danced away the last day of a summer favorite. I got some apples, some string beans. And today is the last day, so I'm going to miss it. It's a wonderful market. It's great for the community to come out, and it's just, I think it's perfect. One of the main attractions is this 1929 popcorn truck. It was a fixture at the park until 1971 when it was sold to someone from out of town. Dale Bryant is part of a group that restored the truck and brought it back to the city. What is the community feedback that you get with the truck? That is the community feedback. People that, I remember when it was right over there on that corner and we used to come here and the problem is we're losing those people. They're dying off on us. So, so there's not as many people now. I mean, I remember it as a kid, I'm 80 years old. Popcorn truck is awesome. We think it's great. We came for the popcorn. Members of the Elmira River Sharks were also there as the new hockey team gets ready to hit the ice next month. The feedback's going well. You know, we have some of our merch out here. Uh, you have the ability to get some season tickets, uh, get the new jerseys. You know, the colors and the logo are going over well. People are getting excited for the hockey season, which is awesome for us. The first Wisner Market was held in 1997. It's organized by Elmira Downtown Development. We had some air quality days. We had some rain. Other than that, the weather's been beautiful. We've had consistent food vendors, um, consistent market vendors, nonprofits. I think it could always be better. Every year can always be better. We can always do something more. I'd love to get more craft vendors in. I know it's during lunch hour, and most craft vendors have full-time jobs, so that is a little difficult, but I'm hoping next year we can work on that. Next, Elmira Downtown Development has Trunk or Treat, and we actually do it right here. Um, that's October 27th. And then, of course, our tree lighting that is also at Wisner, and our parade. I think it's going to be our 65th year, so we're really excited for that. For more information about the vendors here at Wisner Market and to learn more about the history of the popcorn truck, we posted the full interviews on our website. That's MyTwinTiers.com. At Wizard Market in downtown Elmira, I'm Nick Dubina, 18 News.